Art is an important aspect of Asian culture. Art has always been present in activities performed in different communities, from celebrations of life to rituals of planting, harvesting, and thanksgiving. Art indeed is a reflection of the ideals, beliefs, and aspirations of Asian societies. Asian art is highly diverse and is greatly influenced by geography, politics, and religion. It is also best characterized by its use of symbols and motifs, from animals, trees, and plants, to other subjects. Each corresponds to a representation of a character or value Asian people aspire to have. These characteristics are evident in Chinese arts and crafts. Chinese calligraphy. The word calligraphy literally means good writing. For the Chinese, it goes beyond exquisite way of writing the characters, for they consider it a form of art requiring mental discipline involving both the body and soul. Calligraphy is a form of self-motivation and self-expression. It is also traditionally regarded as the highest form of visual art. Historically, it served several roles in the lives of early Chinese. For example, a scholar could not pass an examination to become an official by having a limited skill in calligraphy. A person's character was also judged by his or her handwriting. For elegant handwriting, was believed to reveal a person's astute character and refinement. Chinese landscape paintings are a reflection 
of the principles and ideas of Taoism. The Song Dynasty is considered not just as the great age of Chinese landscape, but also the golden era of Chinese painting. Artists like Kosi, Fan Fan, and Ji Hao believe that the volume of landscape painting is based on its capacity to make viewers feel as if they were really in the place. For example, this. This idea can be best represented by the hands growth of cool sea, clearing autumn skies over mountains and valleys. Okay, it's like you're in here, it's like you're in the painting, and that is the characteristic of a Chinese landscape painting. The purpose of Chinese landscape painting is to grasp an emotion by catching nature's rhythm. The theme of the paintings are of flowers and birds, landscapes, temples, human figures, animals, bamboos, and stones. Ink wash painting, also known as Shui Mo, is a type of brush painting of Chinese origin. It makes use of the same black ink used in calligraphy. Chinese calligraphy as well as painting were done on silk, which was replaced by paper in the first century. Works by famous calligraphers are mounted on scrolls and hung on walls like paintings. Materials used for calligraphy are brush pen and black ink. Brush pen made of animal hair and the ink that is made from pine soup and animal ribson. Architecture Ancient Chinese architecture is considered as one of the significant elements of the world's architectural system. Chinese pagodas dominated the landscape of every town in the country. The pagodas were commonly fashioned and constructed from octagonal bricks and usually had 3, 5, 7, 9, or 13 stories since even numbers were considered unlucky for Chinese. They housed relics of Buddha and sacred writings on every floor, giving a shroud of potency and mysticism to the entire structure. One of the most prominent pagodas is the Porcelain Pagoda, which was built during the Ming Dynasty in 1431 at Nanjing, China. It was an octagonal structure ornamented with three colored porcelain and large gold ball surmounting the roof. And now we're here in the famous landmark in China. The One of the amazing feats of Chinese civilization is the Great Wall of China. It was constructed during the reign of Emperor Qin Shi Huang during the Qin Dynasty in 221 BC. The wall stretching 6,000 kilometers is considered the longest pre-modern architectural structure. It is one of the seven wonders of the world and was granted the World Heritage Status by UNESCO in 1987. It was originally constructed using earthen materials during the Queen Dynasty, but would later be reconstructed during the Ming Dynasty into the stone and brick wall tourists see today. It is estimated that up to one million people died while constructing the Great Wall, making it the longest cemetery in the world. Archaeologists have even discovered numerous human remains buried under sections of the wall. China's outstanding feats in architecture, 
engineering and art showed the skills and handiwork of some of the world's greatest ancient empires and civilizations. Since China is one of the world's largest storehouse of art, literature, science, technology, and philosophy, their contributions to the development of modern-day civilization are of great importance.